Hello. Um, yeah, I'm calling about your 1989 rental, uh, boat. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah, do you sell that for sale? Yeah, I do. Okay, uh, now, uh, what kind of condition is this boat in? Uh, still more than suitable. Uh, um, right, like if I took it out in the ocean? Well, I guess if the waves got kind of high, I think it'd be rough, but... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, yeah, yeah, you can take it, uh, you can put it in your bathtub or put it on the Pacific Ocean. Either way, it's going to be, be mine, so... My bathtub? I'm not that rich, man. Come on. <laughs> yeah. I'm from but, you know, it's, uh, it's, I mean, uh, if you're looking for something that floats, it floats. All right. And the answer... Okay. Okay. Is is the live? It has a live well in it, right? And it, it is it right? Is it what? It's got a live well, and it, it does like holding everything. Well, so to speak, it's uh, it doesn't have live well like you find on a bass boat. Oh, okay. So, uh, well, but it has a, it's got a thing underneath one of the seats that could double as a cooler or a live well. Like it is tossing water in it. Okay, well, I was looking at the boat, and I seen that, like, wooden thing in the middle of the floor, and I didn't know what it was. So I was Oh, that's just a, that's a storage bin for skis, flags, stuff like that. Oh, skis, you know, okay. So it can pull a skier? Yeah. Pardon me? It can pull a skier? It can pull two skiers. Oh, so that's like, a, or it can pull, like, one, like, 300-pounder? Uh, I think it might, it could pull a, it could, it's probably only one 300-pounder, you know, getting yeah. it up out of the water. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. You, know. you might have to pull them up on combos. I don't know if it, I've never had anybody that's 300 pounds get up behind it, but. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got this man, my buddy, my buddy, he's a big boy, and he, he likes to ski, but his boat just broke down, so I'm looking for, for one. We can, we can, uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm sure it would pull him up on two skis. You know what I mean? Pull them up and then drop one. Okay. Um, but I, I don't. I've never. I've just never had anybody behind it uh, on a, uh, you know, that that weight with one ski. Okay. But it's pretty powerful. So I, I mean, I wouldn't doubt it if the guy can hang onto the rope for a second and knows how to ski. I bet it would probably pull him right up. So. Okay. Okay. Yeah, he knows how to ski. He uh, he's pretty good at it. Yeah, yeah, I he can do it. I mean, if he, you know, if he knows how to do it, keeps it tucked up and then just jerks himself up, I'd, I'd imagine it probably would. But, you know, like I said, I've never pulled anybody up that, uh, that weighed that much. Now, did you, now did you guys ski in it? And, I mean... Oh, yeah, yeah, we skied, skied, and uh, uh, more, more tubing, you know, because the kids just didn't care about skiing for, I don't know why, kids these days just uh, don't like it. Don't like the challenge like we did. <laughs> yeah, I love that challenge. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so uh, it's a great ski. Well, the guy, I've had it for about six years, and the guy I got it from had it uh, specifically for skiing. It doesn't have a pole, you know, uh, it's old enough that it doesn't have the spot in the middle of the floor for a pole. You know what I'm saying? Okay, okay. So, okay. So, so it doesn't have that. I don't know when they started putting those in, but I'm, I'm, I think it was probably 92, 93, somewhere. In yeah, there. yeah, yeah. And uh, now, are are you budging on your price? Uh, you know, on your price a little bit, or is it you know firm twenty eight? Yeah, I gotta go twenty eight. But there's uh, you know, there's a way. You know, I know other you know, other people that do a uh, uh, couple things. I'm not saying I would or anything like that, but you know, with the price and uh, there's there's a couple ways to save you a little bit of money in the long run on it. Okay, okay. <laughs> if you know what I'm talking about, I don't know if you work for the law or anything like that, so... No, 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 I'm not no law enforcement here. I'm just a good old boy from Arkansas looking right. for both. Well, what you can do for... I say you can save you some money on the sales tax so it'll knock off, uh, uh, you know, pretty close to 300 bucks. Okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So when you go to register that bad boy, um, you know, it's going to save you some money that way. Okay, okay. Uh, man. It looks like a pretty nice boat. Well, where, where are you living? You're not in Arkansas right now, are you? Yeah, I am. Are you? <laughs> That's a long drive. <laughs> uh, us, we're, uh, 
You know, we like our we like our boats. So right, right. Now, now on one of them boats, I don't know if uh, it's legal or anything. We we like to do a lot of, a lot of things called a uh, bow fishing down here. We'll get our bows and we rig them up and uh, shoot fish with them. Right. Now, is that legal to shoot? Is that boat legal to shoot or boat legal to shoot out of or uh, no? I, I don't remember. I don't remember the statistics on what they said about that on about the boat. Well, I I guess I've never. Uh really thought about that. I've never done that here. I know you can do it with uh, the kokanee, kokanee salmon that are that are up on the South Fork on a certain time of year when they're going to rot anyway. Yeah. But, um, I, I, I don't know, my friend. I couldn't honestly tell you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, that sounds like fun. I've, I've uh, got them with a javelin before, but you know, up here, I don't know if you're going to ever get to a place where you're going to be able to see a fish to you know, to uh, be able to, to skewer one. <laughs> yeah. Well, oh, man, what? Mm, the price. The price is where it really gets me, I'm telling you. Man, it's a nice boat, and, you know, if I just had if I just had that money. Yeah. Oh, it's a really good deal. I, you know, I lowered it down because I don't want to have to winterize it. I'd rather get rid of it than winterize it. And, yeah. And, uh, you know, up here in Idaho, it's getting pretty close to... You know, I probably got about a month. You know, I started up for somebody the other week, so, you know, it, it still fires right up. I just, uh, you know, I got to keep an eye on the weather, and if it's going to get down to, like, 10 degrees or something right here, I'm going to have to, you know, drain all that, that water out. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that'll, that's not good when it gets that yeah. level. Well, it's okay. It's, it's no big deal. It's just I don't want to have to do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mm. Man. Hmm. Well, let me let me think about it. You know, uh, you're not looking for any like maybe you know sexual gestures or anything. Sexual gestures? Well, a gesture uh, uh, from a guy? No. <laughs> not from a guy. <laughs> not from a guy. No. Oh man, man, man. Yeah, yeah. Not even even not even an innuendo. <laughs> Maybe it's em- I'd go for an empty gesture, but that's all. <laughs> yeah. Well, I was just offering because you never know. Mm. Yeah, no, no, you uh, you couldn't do enough for me for the boat, not even for my lawnmower. <laughs> I tell you what, I did give one heck of a blowjob, though. No, uh, no, you couldn't for me because uh, I just wouldn't uh, be anything. I I don't think I could uh, be be excited for you. Be excited? <laughs> I'll get you excited. Yeah, I don't think so. No, All right. I really don't think so. So uh, maybe you can find someone down there in Arkansas that will go for it. <laughs> yeah, hopefully. <laughs> maybe my friend. Well, will. Yeah, I have to be a really good friend. So yeah, my girlfriend would be pretty disappointed if I if I uh, took a Hummer for that boat. <laughs> 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 Otherwise, she'd already have it four or five times over. <laughs> <laughs> So uh, I don't know what to tell you, buddy. I don't, you know, maybe you can you can find what you're after out there. All righty. Okay, you take care. All right, you too. I love you. Kane.